Welcome back. I'm Jory, and this is the last like haul that I'm having before SAS because SAS is coming. That semi annual um, sale from Bath and Body Works. If you don't know, they have candles like I guess from 50% to 75. Well, like body care and all that stuff. Um, everything, a little bit of everything at SAS. Um, but I'll be looking for candles. Um, probably 75% off candles. Um, usually 75% off. If it's a popular one, I say go ahead and get it at 50% if you have a coupon or something. Um, I guess it's like a SAS pregame that I have <laughs> tips. Um, I'm usually going to get... Like seventy five percent off candles that I don't have in collection, or if I want one backup, usually I do probably like two backups or something, maybe three if I really love it, two if I like it, three if I love it. Um, I'm just looking at my candles up there. So that's my game plan for SAS. Also, um, it's hard to find like really gems like you used to find like old, like packaging or some old like older candles. That came out that was unique um so i probably won't get that much for sas because it's probably mostly probably going to be like newer packaging newer scents um so i want to stick to getting 75 percent off candles first if i see 50 percent off um i might pick it up because my online order from counter they did get counsel so they did send me a um coupon i got refunded for it and a coupon so i do have one coupon for sas because i think my the coupon that they sent me um bath and body sent me i think it don't expire to february so um so that's my game plan but let's get into the haul this is a haul from the twelve ninety five. I had one more um, ten off for the coupon that I didn't use for Canada Day. Um, that a friend gave to me. Like she not she get like some every now and then she get coupon, but she really don't go to bathroom by words. <laughs> so she gave me the ten off forty, but it was um because she was out. So she came back into town and but that was after Canada Day. So um I decided if they do a decent sale, I use the 10 out 40. So I used that one coupon to do an in-store order and a pickup order. So that's what I did. I picked up um eight candles because it was $12.95 and then 10 out for 40. So let's get started. Um, first I put back this candle because I was like, I don't know, but I then I was like, let me just get at least one. So it's hot pink and cocoa. So it smells really good. And the notes are, uh, sweet, ruby chocolate, whipped vanilla cream and raspberry sprinkles. It seems like a lot of people has burned this one and they say they like it. So I just picked up one of these because I didn't pick it up during candle day. So out of this one, I picked up the white chocolate macadamia. So I ended up just picking up one. I might pick up one during SAS just to have another one, but um, it's like raspberry. It's for it on cold. A little sweetening the chocolate seemed to be a background note so i just got one of those let me bring the table um, so with this one i didn't like the body care but everybody was like as far as me seeing reviews um people was like the candle is better than the body care so that's why i picked it up Finally picked it up because I was just passing her by. Um, and it's none other than Luminous 
And a lot of people say the candle is better than the body care. And this one smells really good. Not too far of the body care. I did have the hand lotion. And I smelled the fine fragrance mist and stuff in the store. And it was just too much. But I do um, like the candle. And it's ruby current. What did it say? Gilded Iris Praline Amber. So I did just get one because with the body care candles, I tend to be not so good at burning them. Sometimes I forget them. <laughs> but they over there and I'm trying to do better in burning them. So that's why I don't get like more than one. Two if I really like, like it. Like I got a, two of the Saltwater Breeze. Cause that's more like a fresh like scent salty scent like really um air not really too perfumey to me or nothing like that or don't really scream to me as body care body care like these do so i usually just get one because i don't like burn them my body care candles like that um, Next, I end up, because I didn't pick up these on counter day, um, but I do like this scent, so I end up getting two, and it's Winter Candy Apple. So I got those two, because I do like it, and I was like, oh, I'll pick it up later. So I end up, and this is Red Apple's crisp pears and candied oranges so i do like it it's really nice it's not too even though it's fruit in it it's more like a give me it's just something in there that's like outdoorsy or something really nice um fragrance like this i like it in candle versus body care because the body care tends to be more sweeter so had to get two of those because I burnt my last one. Like I probably have this one like 21 or something, I believe. Or, so or 2020, something like that. So I haven't had it in a while, but I do enjoy it. And I did like this packaging. They have another one with the writing on it that um like the English toffee candle, so I thought that was cute. Um, yeah. Let me take the candles out the bag. Next, I usually saw this at Candle Day, and I usually like pick up, try to find these at SAS, but one SAS, I mistaking this for another candle i was mistaking another candle for this and i was looking for this but the name tripped me up so first one i got is the um water mint lemonade and one store i remember had the pink lemonade on sale and i was like can't remember if i like the watermelon lemonade or the pink lemonade and it end up glad i do like videos i went back to my video and it was the watermelon lemonade and i remember seeing a couple of for 75 percent off but when i went back they were gone so i just got one right now and this is watermelon Meyer lemonade and sparkling water and i just love the ombre i would say so that was nice so if i don't see it or it says for 75 percent at least I have one because um, this one goes so fast and you know I usually um, get to the store I used to get to the store early but I don't know due to the fact that it starts when I work I'm not gonna be there in the morning to see like if they have 75% off so um, I just be checking periodically but 
Since I only have one coupon for SAS, um, I see what I see. My goal is like to get maybe a decent amount for that first coupon then. Um, but if I don't see this one, at least I have one and I love it. It's a good throwing candle as well. Um, oh, it's a I. I was looking at these notes, but let's see. It's a watermelon ice, sparkling water, and Meyer lemons. Oh, okay, I don't have the watermelon ice. Okay, on the top, but yeah, so good. So. If I find this at SS, I definitely picked up. This is a good one. It definitely throws pretty good. So I just got one. Like, I was hoping I'd find that one at SS. Like I said, I picked up pink watermelon, thinking that was the one, but it was actually watermelon lemonade. So now I know, and I keep my eyes on it, because these are still this um, collection with Bergamot Waters, Pineapple Mango, um, what's that drink one? Island Margarita, I think. They still like heavily in the store, so um, hopefully I could get a few of those for SAS. I get at least two more. Next, this one is, I don't went to a couple stores and this one is like sold out. Um, and I only see the other parts of this collection. It was, I think, four in this collection. So I ended up picking up a one store, had one more left on the shelf. And it was like I saw the other three, but this one was behind like the first row of candles. And something told me, like, look over there, and I moved one candle and it was right behind it and it was just one left when i moved a couple more it was just one left and it's merry mimosa so i wanted to get i meant to pick up another one because i have one already i meant to pick up another one during um counter day but when i went back like the second day and third day i couldn't even couldn't even find this one in my few stores i have near me so i end up going to a store that um i normally don't go to i think it's a newer store that opened up by um my job location so i ended up picking up this one because you can't find it in the store now well as of right now because this one had vanilla balsam that cranberry parabellini which i already have and vanilla balsam now you see those three but this one is um gone in my store and this one like i said was hidden so when you go in a store you know if you don't if you see a counter in a collection that you like just move them because sometimes they put them like in the back of the other ones that they want to sell i guess um but yeah mary mimosa and it's sparkling champagne red apple slices and ice sugar crystals this is good so good um i finished one this year so that's why i wanted to get two more because i like this one it gives you it's in the family of like champagne toast and like maybe a bubbly rose um kind of vibes but i just like this one um this one and bubbly rose is neck to neck those two i like i don't really like champagne toast but so if that's your vibe get this one it got sparkling champagne which is like the other two i mentioned they got like the champagne on, I think. And then the red apple slices and sugar crystals. This one throws really good. Like I burnt one and it's so good. So I'm glad I found one more because that one is getting gone in store. This one, last but not least, during like calendar day, people looking for like what's new or picking up a few backups and the white barn core packaging usually not my like item to go to or on my list really really to pick up during candle day but that's to me like now that i think about like to me 
don't overlook that one. That's my tip. Cause I don't think like the white, like the core packaging usually be this cheap unless it, you know, all candle sales. Um, but they still tend to get looked over the core packaging of white barn. So, um, definitely check that out if you have some favorites on there. So this one, I ain't, I want, I needed two more candles to get the 10 off of 40 deal. Um, so I end up picking up these two because I like this scent. I burned it before. So that's why I went over to the core. I was like, let me see. Cause it's the other stuff I either get, I already have, or not really interested, but these two, these, um, really was one of them that I like and it's none other than Lakeside Morning so I ended up getting two of those like I said the white core packaging usually get kind of overlooked during like candy or like maybe they'll pick them up during SAS I'm not sure but the notes are crisp autumn air white driftwood and a hint of green apple so this is a good um morning candle that's when i burned it it's just fresh like a fresh outdoorsy crispy kind of smell with a hint of the apple you definitely get the apple note when you um burn it so that's late side morning and i was like i haven't replenished this when i burned it the first time so i said let me get it now um because it's so good definitely like i burned this like probably spring even winter i think like january or february or springtime um it's a good little counter for that i think it's but yeah that's what it gives me so lakeside morning i just wanted that in my collection because i do like it so that is it um mm, lakeside morning so good so that is it just want to show you these so I can put them up and get ready for SAS. But I don't think I pick up a whole lot from SAS because, um, like I said, with the re new return policy and stuff, you don't see too many hidden gems. But we shall see. So take care and have a great day. See you next time.